welcome to my channel thank you for watching be sure to do me a favor and subscribe like and press the notification bell you guys be blessed love you okay so we're in a pilot this is her first time showering at a truck stop this is our first shower of the trip okay so we pausing because i want y'all to pay attention to the smile on my face you guys I don't think Morgan realized that I had taken a solar shower earlier that day. So the fact that I was about to take a real shower, I felt like she was giving me diamonds and gold and everything else in between. Because them thighs can't just keep on rinsing off. I need to deep clean them thighs. Them big girl thighs. And I like to add in hindsight that I went a little bit overboard with the shower. I was in the shower so long that Morgan started calling me. To make sure everything was okay. I was in the shower so long. That I feel like I need to send Flying J a check. For the light gas and water. That's how long I was in that room. Like they might have a new rule next time I come. Because of me. Because I, I think I took advantage of every minute. That they did not knock on that door. And say ma'am are you okay. So we're going to go ahead and let Morgan finish giving us the grand tour. Of the shower at Flying J for $12. these like things now that you can hold up to see if there's any type of hidden cameras rigs majority of people on the internet believe that there's hidden cameras and that all the janitors are spying on you so i'm gonna leave you with that thought and enjoy your show look you guys this is the advertisement for our super solar shower the device that Morgan purchased from Walmart for approximately $6 so that we could take showers while we were at the campsite. Y'all see how she's smiling to happily be taking a shower with that mechanism? She is selling that because that is not the look I had on my face when I had to rinse myself off with that. Let me show y'all how this works. So you got to get some water. Morgan was like, we're at South Dakota near the springs. Let's get some of this spring water. Now me, being from Memphis, not really understanding, I'm trying to figure out how the water get clean. How is this water able to be put on my body without having to go through a purifier? Like, how does this work? Um, well, unbeknownst to me, the rocks clean it. The rocks provide minerals that makes this water so pretty it's a natural cleaning it still really don't make sense to me because i'm like where does the fish is fish in the spring they're peeing they're not going to the restroom they're peeing right there i don't know how it works but the water was clear that's what i can tell you now we're gathering it we're putting it inside the solar shower we're trying to fill this bad boy up it's not as easy as it looks it does not come with one of those little funnels for you to just pour it into it you got to get that bad boy you got to like do it like a water balloon baby um morgan she had figured out the trick so she actually had to do mine for me as well but we eventually get all the water in there and morgan's trying to still explain to me how go ahead and wake yourself up with the spring water and i was just like baby we got to stop calling it hot springs because it's freezing cold so we take the water with us throw it in the back of the truck and a couple days later the temperature finally warms up to where i could take a shower outside and i'm like oh, okay we get to use the solar shower so i set mine up i get all my stuff together because i'm like good grief we don't really have like i can't do it in the porta potty where i'm taking a shower i got to take it outside free born free free as the wind blows so I put mine up on her. She has like a pole at the top of the Bronco. And I rig it up. Now, as you see, I have my blanket because the towels were used to clean up a mess that the kittens made in the Bronco 
wasting their water everywhere. And I only bought a couple of towels because you don't have a lot of room in the Bronco anyways. Now, I tried to turn it on and get the water going, get the water coming out. And I was able to rinse off some body parts, basically my front parts. But yeah, I just really didn't like how I was feeling. So I attempted going to do the William Hoff method which is going out to a water in the cold but that wasn't for me either so i just ended up with wet rain boots as you see and was like yeah this ain't gonna work so morgan figured out something for me and, and this is okay, so why this is i'm so pilot. excited shower. to see the room with the shower nice full and shower Ooh, nice and cozy this one kind of looks like it has black mold I'll talk to the person about that, but I'm not gonna lie, I still showered. <laughs> My body was dirty. Um, nice hand soap. They got a fan, which I cut off because I'm not trying to catch a cold. A nice mirror, place to hang your stuff up. It does not come with like blow dryer, shampoo, conditioner, any of that stuff. So you have to bring that to yourself. But they did not bother me. I've been in here for about 30, 40 minutes. And yeah, it's cool. Came with towels. You got your big towel. Big towel. Then you got the wash towel. Then you got just a regular um, body towel. So if you find yourself out in the wilderness and in need of a shower, be sure to try apps like iOverlander, Campendium, and Seeker. Other options could be recreational centers or gym memberships because they offer free showers. And let us not forget about the thing that blessed us, the pilot gas stations. And there's other gas stations that offer those services as well, like Flying J. Now, keep in mind that I want you to live, laugh, love, and remember that Don knows best. Love you guys. Be sure to subscribe.